What's going on, everybody? KD for the Wealth Wells. We're going to do a quick trade recap for the day. Today is 7-7-2023. Seven, seven, we ended the day 7-7. Seven for seven. Let's talk about it, and let's give you some developmental training on uh, how we were able to crush the day. Six-figure day, nice profits. Let's get into the Discord. We were in the live channel with everyone, free access, spy-only options Friday morning. My schedule is here. You can see where I'm at. And you can come into the Discord, take special training, mindset Mondays, indicators, all that stuff is here. Uh, come into the Discord, you'll be you'll be you know pleasantly surprised with that, and you can follow the you know the uh, uh, the Discord and how to gain access to it. But let's go all the way back to 3 a.m. this morning. I I already did a post for this, so if you want to find out about this trade right here that yielded uh, per trade 4k, but it was a total of about 20k. I did four trades like this. Then uh, for those who are in the private channels. Inside of the futures channel, uh, these folks here understand where the callouts are all the way back to 3 a.m. You can see it here. Boom. I push, post a call out. Got a 15, 20 point move on that. Very fine. That started my day. So I want to be very transparent with you. This put me up already significantly. And then I used the profits to maximize that throughout the day. All right. What did we do? Okay. So let's go ahead and take a look at our spy on the options room and go back to uh, the open. Okay. Right out the open. Right away, I'm in calls. I'm scalping 4406 SPX. Let's take a look at that. So loaded up on a nice position right here out the open. Boom. And we got a run up. Let's go over to SPX. Check that out. Here's the run up right here. 4406. We trailed it and got a two candle break to the upside. All right. So that's the first trade. After that, um, uh, I want to help you with something too. And so what I, what I used this morning uh, in addition to my key levels uh, was the VVP indicator. Now, the VVP indicator is a proprietary indicator with a script running in the background. It does not include the volume profile. That's a separate indicator that'll be available this month as well. This is my very own volume profile. It has level two like data. This data shifts throughout the day. It gives me an edge. It shows me the dominant side of the trading uh, house who's who's winning throughout the day, throughout the move. And it works in harmony with my levels, static, and my uh, um, research level. So everything is here on my screen. What I've done is try to develop something that a trader could just use one single screen, not multiple screens, one single screen. Now, yes, I trade multiple securities. I trade multiple um, different um, uh, stocks and, and many things. So I have multiple screens, but to make my trades throughout the day for the S&P, I boiled it down to one screen for those of you guys who want to use the levels there. Now, there are some deep things that you need, and we'll go over that, all right? So how to get to that stuff, no problem. Go ahead and take the KD setups, go through the core training from zero to 4.5. You can take the swing, and then you can get down to the, to the other training there. All right, so after my run up there, let's keep going down the line here. Uh, we take it to our target. You can see others banking around the market. Yep, thanks, KD, needed that one. No problem, here to help. Banking, banking, banking. We trailed tightly again. I got the caught the continuation. Others banking, 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 banking. Stack three for the three for the morning. Okay, no problem. Caught the pop down. Some of you guys inputs for the ROV. Took that bank there four for four. You can see, I took a loss. I'll show you where I took my loss at in calls here. Expected this thing to break, but it didn't break fast enough. Right now, I could have held the position. I could have waited. It was around this time frame right there. I could have held this thing. I could have waited, but um, I didn't like the price action at the time. It was at 11 o'clock move right here, just slightly early to the trade. Let's go over to SPY so you can see it. Of course, I'm trading SPX, but there's the, there's the move on SPY. You can see it there, but a little early to the trade. Sorry, SPX. A little early to the trade here at 11 o'clock right there, right? And ultimately, we did break, but the trade did hit my stop loss, right? I said I would have a 439.80 um, in this area, stop loss, got stopped out, had the wherewithal to get back in. So this is the minor loss I took for the day. Everybody takes losses. It is what it is. But you can see my level. See this level here, not the VVP levels. These all harmonize. But I'm going to give you a little secret right now. When you're using my indicator and you see that you have major confluence like this, when you have any kind of confluence where my levels, your own proprietary levels match up, with the automatic uh, VVP levels, you've got gold every single time. So I know for a fact, coupled with the VVP or with the volume profile, once we get past this area, 
I would need a rush of volume to get past this. Once, once we get past that area, boy, oh boy, it is to the moon. And we took the trade all the way up to our next target. Once we held above there, I just simply trailed. Once we broke beneath there, coupled with the VVP indicator, you can clearly see some line breaks and some indicators and some signals here that tells me, hey, you need to take this trade. So once I see that, then what I do is I simply identify what's happening, identify the volume there. Once we get break, once we get the break down before, uh, down past there and scalp this thing and do some long holds all the way down. And guess where we end up back to the opening range break was a textbook day, six figure day for me. You can clearly see some of the profits just in the morning here. Again, I took four of these trades. I only could screenshot one of them as we came through here, right? It was just a simple um, scalp and hold one, Scalp and hold two, we came retest, scalp and hold three, and then out the open, we took another couple here to the run up there. So it was very, very simple, very, very straightforward there. And I posted the call outs for everyone there. If you want to see the early morning trade recap right here, here's the video 4K to start your day. If you want to learn how to do just a few thousand, one to two, one to 4K in the morning, I can show you how to do that there. And then the best times to trade today. Uh, every single day. Now, I did a video here. Folks have asked me, hey, what's your setups per session per day? Here's the video to do it. So watch the video there. You'll get the goods and understand what the morning session, midday and afternoon session brings you. Six figure day for the opening. We did an open range breakout. This it harmonizes with my setups, right? And the best times of day to trade. So, so um, if you want to learn a little bit more about my setups and kind of what I'm looking at, then you have to take this training right there, KD Setups. I release one per month. Flat out, it gives me an edge. No doubt about it. This That's undeniable. Nobody can speak against it at this point. I've been in the public eye now for nearly uh, almost two years. Uh, it, it's evident, right? The guy can trade. You guys see the skill. And we've been developing folks to trade. Folks have been coming into the Discord and crushing this thing, making more money than they make on their job. You can read that here, making money that they've made in other uh, that they've lost in other discourse to the tune of half or 50 to 100 K. Uh, they've made that back here. And then we've got folks, uh, not just me, making high fives and six figures in a day right there. All right. So that's it. That's the recap for the day. This wraps up an awesome week. It's been a very successful week, a very profitable week. And so far, our um our, our reading of the market has been very, very spot on, and I credit that to the VVP indicator, which automatically charts key levels, areas of interest, signals to enter and exit based on the VVP trading system. I am not a huge um, you know, promoter of lagging indicators, but this is not. Obviously, you can see the levels stretch forward. This is not a lagging indicator. It's something that I use to absolutely crush it. It's KD in a box. You can get your hands on if you like. As I see the breaks, uh, as I see the signals and the information there harmonizing with my levels, you can see that there, then uh, we go ahead and we crush it off of those. Now, the levels are posted every single day and adjusted every single day in this channel right here uh, so that you can get, get it going. And then the private access, uh, you have swings, you have stocks, you have futures, you have other additional information and training for you to help you crush this thing and take your trading to the next level. So seven for eight today or breakout level break six figure day was an awesome week. I'll see everybody uh, bright and early Monday. For those who are tuning in Sunday night, we do a weekly prep here on Zoom inside the Discord. Uh, that information will be announced inside of the general channel right before uh, the session starts about 8 p.m. or so. We'll start at 8.50 right here in this channel right here. And in addition to that, we also traded IWM calls. I almost forgot to mention that. It was a short move, wasn't huge, just a 15% trade here. Um, that this, this number does not include the IWM, so I'm actually um, eight of nine. But you know, this was a bonus here. We, we traded small caps of the upside. Here's our targets. Let's take a look at that right now as well. You can see all the call outs. Boom, there we go. There's our target. You can clearly see right there. After we got the break and the move to the upside aggressively, the call out was made, the hold, and then the continuation. I uh, took the trade all the way up to 18528 um, and above. 18570 was my overall target, right? So uh, once this thing began to, to break to the upside, right? 185, see 185, here we are. 28 was here. And that's where we decide to. to uh, grab our first target. And if we held beyond there, I stated that we will go for the rest of the gap fill and we did. So that's 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 the move. That's how we did it. That's how the day went. 
I encourage you guys to come into the Discord, click the link down below and stay, stay for a while. Understand, hey, there's a guy out here that understands how to trade. That's crushing this thing. And uh, you can do yourself a favor, take the trainings, understand the video trainings there, go ahead and uh, take the courses there. You can go through the stack there, understand, join, and join the tier three. This is where I am to do my call outs and proprietary training, ad hoc training, live training, all that. And you get access to all of the other private channels down here. It's been a pleasure with you guys this week. I look forward to uh, trading with you guys next week. We'll be 8.15 on Zoom here for our weekly prep, and then it'll be posted on YouTube. Uh, KD for the Wealth Wells, signing out.